Each year, thousands of people die in their own home. There's a technology that exists since the 1800s that allow you to safely leave your house in the event of a fire. Unfortunately, many people don't even know what this technology is, even though it costs on average only $1.61 per square foot of your home. For a little bit less than the cost of putting a granite countertop and stainless steel appliances in your house, you can actually have this life-saving technology. Unfortunately, we go to a lot of fires right in this very town where people have been hurt and killed and their batteries are missing from their smoke detectors or their smoke detectors are missing completely. Sprinklers, when coupled with a smoke detector, almost guarantee your survival in a fire situation. They are starting a small fire. There is no gasoline or accelerants used in this fire. You may think we poured gas on there to make it more dramatic. That did not happen. That is not the case. We're simulating somebody either discarding a cigarette or leaving a portable space heater too close. sitting in that room right now you'd be wet but as an old friend of mine used to say it's easier to dry things out than unburn them the smoke that you see there is mainly steam because it's cooling the fire down and there is only one fire sprinkler head in that room Firefighters have just got on scene. They're not even using a hose, they're just going to use a fire extinguisher. There is a little bit of fire, but that sprinkler's point is that it's going to hold the fire at a small level until the fire department gets there. It may even just put out the whole thing totally. But you can see the difference between the sprinkler and the non sprinkled side. We really want to show people how quickly a fire develops and how little time they actually have to get out of the house. If you're like me, you take a couple minutes to get out of bed in the morning. Imagine in the middle of the night, you're sleeping and you wake up to your smoke alarm. That is if your smoke alarm has batteries and it's functioning. You literally only have 30 seconds to a minute to get out of your house before you die. When the, when the planes hit the World Trade Center, a lot of people die, and we still hear about it on the news. And yet, in our country, in the United States of America, one of the most advanced countries in the world, thousands of people die in their own homes every single year, and it's totally preventable. We, we respond to almost 4,000 calls a year for service. Of that, we have about 25 structure fires, similar to what you saw today. And how many of those have fatalities? Uh, this past year we have one, in the last three years we've had six. And in those homes that had the fatalities, did they have sprinkler systems? No. Do you recommend to have a sprinkler system? Absolutely.